Hey, everybody. Starting so we're going to do something different stream. today. We're going to be hopping into Fallout 76 Wastelanders with no delay. Let's switch to it. Here we are. Crazy. Um, there's a <laughs> Steel Dawn expansion that's coming out. Or wait, it's what's it called? There's a Steel Rain or something like that. Coaster Passion with the 100 bitty cheer. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, Coaster Passion. Yeah, so Steel Rain comes out in summer in a couple months here. I look exhausted. <laughs> I'm a little Thanks, tired. Man. I didn't get much sleep. You sure know how to compliment a guy. I want to get back in. Get back into it, Boogie. <laughs> we, uh, there's a new expansion called Steel Dawn, and that's what we're going to be playing. Well, it's not too new, but we waited till the tail end of it before the part two comes out. So now we can play part one, and then part two comes out. We can play that. So uh, mm. why don't we show you guys what we got going on? But first, I wanted to, like, isn't there, like, ambient music? Uh, there is um, classical radio. I turn the music up and I hear something. Thanks, Coast Depression. Got a little. Short. Okay. Well, how do I set my radio again? It's been a minute. Yeah, so uh, I, ju I just hear music. Your pit boy. Um. Yeah, we don't we don't want any copyright stuff, but I, I do want the just the ambient, you know. <laughs> Legion, is this a dream? Is Channel Five on? Yep. Yeah, it's uh, definitely a dream. <laughs> I'm I'm yeah. a, I'm half asleep. Shh, I think. Go to sleep. <laughs> uh, Coaster Passion with the house. Thank you, buddy. Thanks. All right. So before we get started, why don't we give you guys a tour of uh, our bases? It's kind of weird because you can see both of our screens. <laughs> um, but we'll start with the top left corner, guys. So uh, I've shown this base off before, but what I did was um, I ripped down the actual house part and replaced it with glass. Because what I want to do is I want to make a more uh, efficient base where I'm going to put crops in here. And because uh, this was one of the unlocks for season two. You get a whole build set for greenhouses. And um, I'm going to fill this up with crops so I can grow crops and then turn that into pr produce and make adhesive and stuff out of it. And um, that'll be pretty cool. And then uh, I got chickens. So this was this used to have like a living room, a kitchen, a bathroom, a bedroom. I have a video up on the channel if you guys want to see it. But uh, I ripped it all down for the greenhouse. Because the the, bed, the housing didn't really serve a purpose other than, you know, just looking at it. So yeah. I still kept my little garage thing. I got a little back door. This is where I do all my crafting and storing. I forgot. It's, it's, it's a work in progress. I didn't put a door on. I still have to put the crops in. So that's one of my projects that I might do for like a cozy stream. Um, but I got like, if you guys see, there's a certain amount of build space that you have. Oh, and I just got a jetpack. Check this out. Woo! Woo! I want that one. So if I look at my build space, you can see this ring. That's where I'm allowed to build. Look how close I fit everything in here. I was actually quite impressed with how I did this. <laughs> so I I've maximized my space, literally. Um, and made I built to the top of it, too. You can't build any higher than this. So I got a bridge water purifiers so you make money off of water uh, purified water and you could also do a lot of crafting with it so i i managed to sneak in three more water purifiers last night and then i got three more over here and i put these stairs here so i can kind of walk thought down you turned into a chair I turned into a chair and I then I have, an I have an i have an i have an acid extractor here and um Acid's like one of the best materials. I have a little love den down here with a boat and a death claw and a little love seat. It's called the Wasteland Love Seat. And this this came with the area, this little pathway and stairs. And this is my shelter. I'll show you guys shelters in a second. Um, so I have this little seedy shed and I have a little collectron that goes around getting scrap for me i have a companion anyone anyone here plays fallout 4 uh she's got the piper outfit from fallout 4 
So Commander Daguerre is my new piper. I got a, a cozy little fire area. Not everyone with piper. I grow corn here, but this corn is gonna, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna rip things down and change it up a little bit. Um, then we have the ammo converter here, and then uh, what makes you special? You can now respec your characters and make multiple builds. And you can literally just change the points around however you please, which is freaking amazing. So glad that they added that in. Here's my little yeah. Foshnot party room with balloons and streamers. And uh, this was from the Hel Helvetia, what's it called? Um, event? Foshnot. Foshnot. Yeah. These are, I got every single mask, including the power armor one. I can show it to you guys here. How do I, how do I do that again? Armor excavator. So I got the old man winter power, oh, it's a power one. father winter helmet. Yeah. So that was really rare. And then the other rarest one was the death claw mask and uh, father winter. And then these are the like the less rare runs, and these are all the commons. So I have every single Foshnot helmet, and then these are my vending machines. And I'm gonna change this up a little bit, but people can buy stuff from me. It's pretty cool. So yeah, that's my build in a nutshell. But I do want to show you guys this new system. Do we still have Boogie in the chat? Because Boogie's gonna be mm -hmm. really interested in this. So <clears throat> check this out. Now you guys, uh, you can build two camps. So there's camp two and camp one, and um, you can place a second camp down. And then now you don't have to worry about like demolishing your old base to make a new one. And there's gonna be more camp slots added in, but what's even cooler is they added in shelters. So here we go, we got a little door that enters into my shelter. How much time do you got on your hands to do that, Jesus? It's not too bad. No, but I have put 600 hours into this game. Um, so yeah, this is a shelter. It's, it works just like your camp, um, but they actually have like a no snapping thing and you can like do precision placement and um, mm. you can you can go ham with this and place things down. So you got to build and it has twice the budget of a camp so you can really go ham. So everybody gets this one for free and um, I just was messing around. I haven't really built anything in here. I just got like all my plushies at a shrine. I don't know. So there it is. L I just want to show you guys the base ones. So the lobby is the one you get for follow up first. So if you're follow up first subscriber, you get this. So that's the like maintenance room. Everybody gets that one for free. It's pretty small, but this is the one you get for being a follow up first member. And I was literally just throwing stuff about um, it's point. All this stuff is pointless, but I get we got some of the stuff from my seasons like I could play like laser ducks and stuff Pew 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 <clears throat> Oh, I don't even know that one. What? <laughs> That's pretty awesome They're all interactable and that's what I love about it um, And there's like this shooting one here. This came from one of the uh, Seasons you get all the stuff for just playing the seasons and it's great. I got like a a train set and uh, punching bags, like all sorts of really cool things. Oh crap, I ran out of food. My guy's starving. <laughs> um, the seasons are actually really good, but you can build a lot of stuff in here. It's big, very, very big. And then there's, you can buy the atrium for like 1500 atoms. And if you're follow up first, you get 1600 a month. So it's basically free. This one is freaking awesome. Um, look how big it is. It's tall. And you can also build floors in here. So what some people do, and it's 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 actually pretty awesome, is they'll um they'll build their own like one. they'll build their own floors inside of here. So where's the big floor? Yeah. So I don't know. They they just they, some you can put grass in here. I don't know. But You'll see people like place floors and stuff and then walls and they'll kind of like make it not seem like a vault anymore, you know? Mm. And then you could do wallpaper and stuff on top of this. So if, yeah, if you do a good job and just fit it all in, you can make multiple levels and make this big kind of 
camp within a camp. Now this one's dope because it has this window here and you can actually go through it. And it has a staircase going all the way back down. What I, what I think I'm going to do with this one is do the wall thing. And so you come in and you feel like you're inside of a build. You won't see any of this anymore. And I'll do a, a too high roof and then there'll be multiple levels. And I'll have a floor right about here. And a secret passageway that goes into here. For like a fireplace door or something. Mm. So this one's pretty big and uh, that's like 1500 atoms. The vault quarters is really insane. This one is like your traditional vault because you could really place a lot of stuff in here. Um, there's a bedroom. There's uh, an aquarium Ugh. with fish swimming around. It's pretty crazy. Uh, another side bedroom here. There's a stairwell going up. You can see the aquarium from the glass below. The floor see you glass. in a bit, three. See you in a bit. Another small room up here. There's another big room up here with little gardens. And then a back room up here. So this one's freaking enormous. And then the last one I got is the server room. Now what's crazy about this is each one of these has a build limit budget of double the your camp size. And they, they all are independent from one another. So I can literally build two camps now and five shelters. Like I can just build for days. Like there's so much you could do. And this thing is freaking huge as well. And it actually has like a, a server room back here. <laughs> It's so crazy. And another side pocket room with little computers and doodads. So you can see I started building something here and it's like perfectly placed so I can snap more floors in, more walls. And um, and then I can line this with wallpaper. And then you won't even know you're in a server room anymore because I'm, I'm going to make it into like almost a fallout fort. So yeah. I was just messing around with how that would work. And it's quite good actually. So that's all the shelters, and then mix that with double camps, and there's a lot more you can do in Fallout 76 uh, today than ever before. Let's see your uh, camp, what you're building there. I mean, I just started again, so there's not much left. I uh, this is the I just put every crafting thing down in here just to make it easy, right? And then I just started. Working on, uh, oh, you're gonna see some weird screenshots, guys. Yeah, <laughs> just so you're ready. <laughs> like, <can't> really <laughs> um, I started a bit on a little house that's here, cute. contemporary, Nothing much. just a little start making a bridge. Pioneer Scouts. Hey, I didn't know that was a thing. No? No. I don't hmm. think I have that. And then... I like the bridge. I just started making uh, oh, my little market. Cool. I like the market. I really wanted to do a market thing, too. You can uh, sell stuff here, guys. So, just so that's why it's there. The cash registers instead of vending machines. <laughs> uh, yeah, he's wearing a dress. Uh, don't ask. <laughs> and he's very sunny. <laughs> nice club. Yeah, so uh, it's, uh, I mean, yeah, and I started... Work in progress. Ju I just started putting stuff down, yeah, so... It's not much yet. Um, got a little toilet. Go away. That's it. Work cool. in progress. So that's our camps. Um, and then we're just going to go play this Steel Dawn. This dramatic. Yeah, I think I can turn it down just a little bit. Uh, that's what I need to do. No, no, it was my... I need to make 0.45 and 10 millimeter. Yeah, I'm, I, I only have a certain amount of ammo. The stream's going to be over when I run out of ammo. <laughs> so I have to go farm <laughs> <Yeah>. some more. <laughs> hey, boss. Time for the best baits. So about that. Uh, I think we all know who's gonna win that. 
It's all just started. It's not, just e started. It's not even fair. No. We can do, do it later. We could do a build off as like a stream. I mean, we also gotta say like, we kinda stopped <laughs> involuntarily for a while. Uh, what do you mean, involuntarily? Oh, I'm going to go bands. Oh, <laughs> new subscriber, Boss Heart. Thank you. Thanks, Boss Heart. How come it's not showing up in my feed? That's weird. Hmm. Is Abby around? I don't know. I don't think so. Uh, I have to craft. Let's get super duper perk card on. You have an unopened perk pack. Yes, I will open that. And now you can um, scrap perk cards and turn them into legendary perk points. And with that, you can get the legendary perk cards, which increase how much special you have, or like you can create more ammunition. There's so many fun things here. And these cards are on I top of these cards. So there's just so much more to it now. Um, I'm going to throw on super duper. And we're going to craft ourselves some corn soup. I had potato soup for lunch. All food. Hydrate. Hydrate. Uranium fever. Not the one I'm looking for. Wait, where's this corn soup? Oh, I have to boil the water. And now look at You can finally craft in batches now. Thank yeah, God. Yeah, that's so good. But I wonder if that uh, thing... Because I, I, when I craft one by one, Super Duper has a chance to proc on each time you craft. Does it count when you craft 40 at a time? It proc for me. Yeah, but it does a proc for all of them or just none of them? Or a little bit of each? I'm just wondering if it's... Mm, that's a good one. Okay, so now we need Not to sure. equip our corn soup. <laughs> and I have a lot of pictures of Beckett. It was for a video, okay? It's on the channel. Uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Thanks. Why is this not showing Thanks, up Mozart. in the mini feed? Uh, is it turned off? I mean, I see a mini feed. It wouldn't be turned off if I see it, right? Hmm. Yes, no. Something weird's going on there. We saw the cheer from earlier. And the host. Oh, no. I see the gifted one to Zell. So, thank you for the gifted sub... Zelixar, you are now a subscriber <laughs> to your own hey. stream. <laughs> it's amazing. Right. I got my Thanks, corn Buffett. soup, and uh, I'm my carry weight's good. You want to do some Steel Dawn? Listen to yeah. the Brotherhood message. I'm going to turn the volume up just a little bit so we can hear these characters and stuff. What is groove music? I'm going to mute that. Wait a second. Huh. All right, buddy. What do we have to do here? Uh, listen to the Brotherhood message. How do I do that? Do your radio. Brotherhood of Steel, welcome broadcast. Let's do it. kind of quiet yeah you are no longer facing the wasteland alone not worry the brotherhood Jingle. has returned I will take good our mission is to help you lead a better safer life free from the dangers what? left behind in the wake of the great war you require your aid or if you wish to join us in our mission find us at fort atlas <laughs> A new dawn is here for Appalachia. Join us in building the future. Romani out. Romani? Okay. We've listened to the broadcast. Go to Fort Atlas. There it is. I forgot. People of Appalachia. This is Paladin Romani of the Brotherhood of Steel. I was like, why am I 400 pounds overweight? But I, did, I have my uh, crafting perks on. 
Oh, which reminds me, I gotta take Super Duper back off. <laughs> Your uh. load screen. <laughs> Oh, oh shit. Yeah, I remember that. Or did you just swimming the, challenge? The, the, yeah, that was, that was uh, fun. Oh, the uh, Marler Queen. Whoops. Um. Yeah, it's gonna keep on running. What was I doing? Oh. Uh, Crimson with the gifted sub to Wixie. Do we got Wixie in the oh. house? No. Oh. <laughs> I don't think so. No? He's playing uh, Apex. <laughs> He's streaming. I gotta give that game another try. I mean, uh, the new season is the new legend is super awesome. She can fly. It looks overpowered as shit. I watched the video. No, because you cannot shoot. And, oh, uh, really? No. I thought I saw fly. I saw them fly and then snipe somebody. Yeah, that's the freaking trailer. I... So it's not real. Why would you show that no. in a trailer if it's not real? Crimson with the gifted I mean, sub to Zephyr. Making all the mods subs. Thanks, Crim. How come they're not subs on their own? Yeah. What the hell? <laughs> What's wrong with these guys? Um, Fort okay. Atlas. Let's... Any news to share? I'm coming to you. Okay, hold on. I, I want to make sure that the audio is just right. So He's trying to play issues with the game. Uh-huh. I'm going to turn, like, the effects down the voice up world radios Hip wow also oh, thanks for the thousand biddies thank you very much wow boss hard freaking legend thank you so much buddy master chat music types are tough and nice footsteps Effects. And now I'm gonna turn the volume maybe, up nice and loud. Maybe or... you should invite me to a team. Yes. You still look the same as like two years ago. <laughs> I like the way I look. I thought it was very unique and very followedy. It's dope. I mean, this yeah, hunt, I'm hunt, just hunter jacket's really rare. It was hard to get. I mean, it's a uh, it's a badass look, and the backpack. Yeah, everything about it. But I've added in the backpack. Oh yeah, that one's pretty cool. Those what the hell? Primsol making that legend wreck a dollar now, making it rain. Dude, you want to see how OP <laughs> this is? Yeah. Watch, I'm gonna go over here. All right, just just watch me. Yeah. Okay. Watch this. <clears throat> Let me get my AP back. The building. Just watch how long I can stay in the air. Wow. It's pretty OP. Yeah. <laughs> you can go far with this. <clears throat> I subbed not longer after affiliate start. Thank you. Shane, champion. Okay, let's talk to uh, hey. Russell. Yeah. Russell Dorsey. Hey, good to see you. What's up, Russ? Welcome to Fort Atlas. Are you buying this? He sounds like such a dork. What kind of brotherhood guy is this? Yeah. Uh, I'd like to speak to somebody in charge, uh, nerd. Looking to sign up, or just curious? Wow. Well, Either way, I guess it's not me. You looks like your plan to. worked, Dorsey. What plan? The oh, they, they we got here. But if you're interested, Knight Shin's in charge of the new recruits. He's very serious about protocol and security, so you'll have to speak to him first if you want to get anywhere. All right. Let's go on in. Brotherhood of Steel. He's from the Sisterhood of Steel. So spooky. <laughs> I I have real duties to Wait, did I just the join with you? I hope so. Oh, but we kind of, you know, you don't want to enter a team leader because then you're going to have to do it again. Right? Your duties are what I say. Because you're in my instance, oh. right? Are noted, but this Crap. Is a order from Remember how that worked? Mm. Help us put on a good face for the oh, this is cool. We've just moved into their back this is all new to me. What are you eating? Radiated noodles? Jeez. If you insist, Paladin. If there's nothing further, I'll have Look at these noodles. Before. They're glowing. Shortly. I expect nothing less from you. As you were, Shane. Oh, where is this guy? Listen to Shin's conversation. Oh. 
Well, apparently we listened to it through the basement. I had no idea what was going on. What's up, Shin? Civilians are supposed to wait to be. This guy looks like you. Look at his eyebrows. Dude. Dude. <laughs> it looks like you. Your Shin. <laughs> If you're here with a request for the Brotherhood, get in line. I don't have time for you right now. I don't have time for you. Or so Dorsey sent me, though. Did he? Initiate Dorsey is supposed to be manning his post. I don't see the resemblance. Not acting as my secretary. It says who, by the way? It's eyebrows. Your own eyebrows. My, my eyebrows are fluffy. Yours are just angry. <laughs> fluffy. <laughs> Dorsey thought I'd be maybe able to help out. Hmm. Initia Dorsey is too trusting, but I can't fault his commitment. Mm -hmm. Perhaps he sees something in you. Whoa! Pink Panther Bree with the hundred dollar tip. Wow! wow. Thank you, Bree. My oh, wow. goodness <laughs> gracious! Thank you okay. so much. Well, there goes that goal. <laughs> <laughs> there goes. So oh yeah, to his our donation goal was literally a hundred dollars. <laughs> wow. Well, uh, well Matt, apparently, thank apparently, thanks to you, guys and gals, we hit our uh, VR goal. So I have to go buy a VR yep. headset when I get my new place and a PS Five. <laughs> yep. Warmgar's in the house. What's up, buddy? Now your new host is two extra square feet. <laughs> okay, charisma. I think I can... I can think of no greater honor than to join your noble brotherhood. Let's do it. If you mean that, then you are right. What's up, Abigail? No pants it. party. Immediately. Oh, Normally, Abby. Warm guards here. What's up, Warm? We want to give you a thank you, Abby, for whatever yes. reason. My I logged into Streamlabs, and it said, uh, for me that would help the "Where is it?" And demonstrate your qualities as a candidate. Hold on, let me hear what he's saying. We've had a number of civilians show up here at Fort Atlas, asking for one thing or another from the Brotherhood. People are afraid, or want something, or are looking to involve us in local squabbles. Civilian outreach is not my specialty. There's too much left to do to secure this facility. If you're really interested in helping. Save my time. Interview the petitioners. Find out what they want and report back to me. Okay. Your donation brings your house up one square feet. Two days ago, Abby donated two hundred dollars. <laughs> what the heck? We weren't even live, <laughs> yeah. and you're just like, I'm gonna donate. So thank you for on that, a Abby. On a Monday. So that was a nice surprise to open up Streamlabs. Yeah, and see. for sure. <laughs> so thank you, thank Abby. Thank you for that. Okay, and other accessories, says Crimson. That's right, we owe you guys uh, a game and a something. Maybe we'll buy that uh, Demon Souls game. Sure, I can do uh, that. This right. Those accessories. Don't make me regret giving you the opportunity. Conduct you some extra profit. rumble packs? <laughs> we can consider Legion <laughs> 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 Grace is donating behind my back. <laughs> <laughs> access to secure parts of this facility, civilian. Was I not supposed to tell anyone, Abby? Okay. Uh, speak to the petitioners. What's their message? You better have some use for the safety. No. I don't think. Let me double check. Nope. I mm. shouldn't ask me to talk to you. Can't even come to me himself. Can't even come to me himself. Poor country girl. All right. Keep it cool, Sean. So, what's he got to say to me? Calculate um, it to make sure you met your VR goal. Oh, the problem thank you. Is that a couple wow. of these brotherhood wow. clowns thank showed you, up and took a bunch of my stuff at gunpoint. Now, I'm a peaceful man. I really am. I sure wasn't equipped to deal Tea with the time is up. Drop everything. Jesus Christ, salt. Don't start a war. <laughs> Never understood the war. Rings. War never changes. I like the quiet. I donate five dollars for a razor to Lord Blaskin. Shave that hat. But after God. this, oh, I get it. 
I came here I think, to give the no, brotherhood a chance okay. to make things right. Shade just the top. Else, maybe. So he gets. I go to crater just the tip. and start doing things their way. At least they don't pretend to be the good guys. What the hell is that? 